how to do icons. Eugenie here and I just had this urge to just come on here because there's something that I keep saying that is really freaking chapping my hide and ruffling my feathers so I really needed to talk about it today. Okay? So um, every once in a while I post um, different posts in, in groups all over Facebook with different options, right? With um, So I work with the elements for those of you who don't know that. So everything I do that, you know, to help somebody, to help badass, avant-garde, un unconventional women to find their amazing style essence, it's all based on the elements, air, water, fire, earth, space, right? A combination of those, okay? So I post um, frequently, you know, different things like different pieces or accessories and things like that that correspond to each of the of the um, elements and then people get to choose which one resonates with them most and then I, I give them you know I say okay that might be a clue that you're water for example right because of these qualities um, in that piece that you chose okay so it's really freaking fun and people seem to dig it right and I've been noticing something very interesting lately okay so I keep getting hey girl what's up miss Shh. So, um, what I've been seeing lately is people, you know, women commenting and being like, oh my God, I'm totally attracted to this necklace, for example. It's so cool. I'm really drawn to it, um, but I would never wear it. It's not something I would normally wear, right? Crickets. That's what I'm hearing. Okay. <sighs> this happens so much, right? This dress is amazing, but oh, I would never wear it because, you know, those heels are too high or they just the colors off or whatever. Okay, here's the thing. We are all drawn naturally to stuff that corresponds to our um, to our primary or uh, as I call it, foundation element, okay? And when we deny that attraction, okay? When we resist and we, our logical mind tells us, no, but you're not supposed to wear that. That's not practical or that, you know, that's too much or whatever the crap, right? When that happens, you are resisting your own true nature. You're resisting what would actually feel fucking amazing on you, okay? So, what I want to invite you to do today, okay? Start noticing what pieces, what garments, what accessories, really just freaking like, oh, just tickle your fancy, just make you feel fucking amazing. And notice if you have that resistance, if you're like, I love that butt, and then excuse, 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 to deny yourself permission to wear it. Notice that. And instead of following that logical part of you that says, no, but this is, those, that's too big, or that's, that's going to get too much attention, or, you know, people are going to look at me weird, or whatever it is, I dare you to fucking wear it anyway. Because that's what Iconic is all about, okay? You face the fear, yes, okay, acknowledge it okay, I'm afraid people are going to think I'm trying to get too much attention or I'm afraid, you know, whatever. I'm afraid this, you know, is a whole part of me that I haven't shown before because that's the thing. Our elements, they really just like, what do they say? Drunk people and little children always are going to tell you the truth, right? So what you're initially attracted to, Icon, right? That's actually your style. It's, right? If you're like, fuck, I'm totally drawn to that. I, I need it. I want it and I'm not going to wear it, right? Because that's not my style or whatever. Explore that. Explore it. Go with that urge. Follow that. That is such a huge clue. That is your intuition, right? When you're like, oh, your intuition's like, please, yearning for it. And then logical mind's like, me more, no, must not do that. So intuition overrides logical mind every fucking time, okay? Override, boom. And you go for that thing that scares you. That's seriously, that's the stuff of icons. That's the stuff that's going to take your style to the next Frick fracking level right there okay so for the next few days like for the next week today's Friday right happy Friday fun day by the way so for the next freaking week when you are attracted to something I want you to give yourself permission notice the fear embrace the shit out of that fear thank you fear thank you excuses and quote-unquote reasons for why I shouldn't wear that or try it on or whatever and then you freaking go for it you're gonna go for it and then just see how you feel Okay, because when you are resisting, right, when you resist, just like, you know, you've heard Abraham Hicks, you know, some of you, 
you go for the path of least resistance, right? We're attracted to something and that could totally fucking be us, but we're resisting and a hamming and a hauling because our logical mind does not agree, right? So follow, just go downstream. Follow what your, follow your fancy, my lady. Okay, follow that feeling. Go for that piece, try it on, and I guarantee nine times out of 10, you're gonna create something really freaking just mind-blowing and magical and next level and iconic, okay? So that is your assignment, your mission, if you choose to accept it, for the next week. Double dog dare you to stare down the fear, notice the resistance, and wear that fucking thing anyway. Can you handle that? I want to get an amen in the comments if you can handle it, if you are, if it's on, okay? Because again, saying, I love this, oh my god, I'm so drawn to it, but I would never wear it. That is some bullshit. You know why? That is not having your own back, okay? I'm apparently this really got me all riled up. Amen. Thank you, Miss Chantel. So you're cordially invited to say F you fear and to just wear it anyway and just see how it feels. And chances are you're going to feel that a little bit of fear, but it's also going to be like thrilling, right? Ooh. Thank you, Sarah. Hey, lovely lady. <laughs> so just do that. Okay. And I'd love for you to like post in here, share with us what is this, what are the pieces that you're noticing that you're attracted to that you've been denying yourself? Share that. We'd, I love pictures, I love lives, anything, however you want to share that, selfies, right? Whatever it is, show us what you've been resisting because chances are that's your jam and you ain't giving yourself permission to just rock out to it. I don't know why I went down that, whatever, that path. So, okay. Challenge accepted. There you are. And um, I'm going to be talking more about the elements as well. So excited to see what you guys come up with when you re stop resisting and just give yourself hashtag permish. I did it again. Okay. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. And I'm so excited to see what happens when you just go for what you're attracted to. Don't deny yourselves. Okay. Mwah. Happy Friday fun day.